Well, there's where our catastrophic failure was. Well, <clears throat> whoever put this on, uh, the gasket on and all that, didn't tight the bolts tight enough, apparently. They just leaked like a sieve out of there, all over everywhere. So, the question is, is does the engine smoke? Should I just go ahead and pull it? Re-ring it and put it back together? Uh, well, you know, I need a new head gasket and all that shit. Because that right there is a telltale sign. It's probably got, with no compression, if the head gasket ain't blowed, then it's collapsed rings. Uh, damn. <clears throat> I know. As I go into it, I gotta spray some stuff on every bolt over here. Well, uh, shit. That catastrophic failure was right there. That and that uh, it had a broke uh, clamp that went on the thing. Oh, shit. Thermostat housing. The clamp was broke on it. So it's leaking there and it's just pouring out here. Uh, that's why it got so hot. It just, you see it right there. It's, well, I don't know if you can see it. We'll get in there some more. Damn bolts in the way. But right there is where the freeze plug is, was, anyway. And I see one in the back that's been uh, put in there. That's a uh, rubber one. Hmm. <clears throat> they probably put a rubber one. Oh, there is. There's a rubber one right there, too. They didn't get that one tight enough, so it popped. <laughs> it's good. I think I'm going to have to pull the whole motor out and we'll just rebuild it completely. That ain't going to be too bad. I mean, well, I'll tear it all the way down to where it's just a block. what I'll do. I'll get it all the way down to there. <clears throat> yep. Okay. Uh, Nanny Nanny Shaw's bought and all that other good shit. There it is. I just got to take it apart. I gotta get that dead gum. Uh, well, no, I'll leave that on there. I don't have to fool with it right now. I'll take it off later. Uh, intake. I'll pull it off. I'm gonna get all that shit off. I can take the valve covers off. Pull the head, and the intake can stay with it. I just have to disconnect all the injectors. Well, yeah. yeah. I don't know. I have to find the bolt for the thing, wherever it is. If there's a bolt that holds that down, or they got clips on them, or something. I don't know. Uh, it's gonna be a job. Well, there's enough room to pull the rail out, though. It's just getting it all out. I, have to... I got one. I think it's for Ford, though. Uh, pull the fuel line right there. So we'll see about that. It's... Man, I had that thing just the other day. I don't know where it is. Alright y'all. Peace. Man, that new shot bot and all that other good shit. And that's about two and a half hours into it right there. Getting it all tore down to this part. Man, it's a booger. Yep. Yeah, I'm going to have to take it. Uh, I don't have to really on that one right there. But get that clutch off. I've got to figure out how to. I'll probably have to go buy a new uh, wrench for it. I'm going to get that clutch off. Alright, y'all, peace. Stand in there, shot about, and all that other good shit. Bye.